a lot of the problems in English uh, with pronunciation can come from this, um, the lack of connection between the sounds and the letters in English. So. English is not a phonetic language, meaning that sometimes a letter makes one sound and sometimes it makes a different sound depending on the combination of the letters. Here's our first sound, the sh sound. This is not a problem to create the sound, sh, very easy, right? The problem comes is when does it happen? How do I know that this sound, or excuse me, these two letters make the sh sound? So we just need some practice and you can start to notice some of these patterns, okay? So for example, this is T as SH. So the word is motion, motion. That sound is right there. This is the T-I-O-N, motion. Very common um, spelling combination in English, the T-I-O-N. So keep that in your mind, Shh. that when you see T-I-O-N, the pronunciation is like this, shun. Motion, generation, election, nation. In some later videos, we're gonna talk about stress. So if you guys heard me say generation, the stress is right here. But maybe as we're looking at some of these longer, more academic kind of words, you can start to pay attention to that placement of the stress, generation, election, okay? Nation, the stress is always before that shun.